Hello everyone, welcome back to Mixpress TV. Hope you're having a great day. A way more calm, David, this time compared to last time we spoke about this subject. My desk. Yes, you all saw the uh, video of me receiving my new desk. Uh, mods and furniture, amazing looking desk. I wanted to keep that a secret until I actually had it here, but we had to release pictures and all that, so I can say it. It's my desk is gonna be a mods and composer custom, amazing looking desk. But anyway, you saw that video. DHL delivered that desk completely destroyed, and this is the update. Unfortunately, the damage was not limited to one side, which was this side here, right where the camera was uh, going to pick up. I will have a multi-camera setup, but one of the cameras was there. The worst possible spot to break was that, not like a chip at the bottom, <laughs> but right there. Anyway, unfortunately the damage wasn't limited to that. Uh, the whole side was shattered and they dumped it so hard that it actually this side hit the other side and even that one was all scratched up and all dented and had cracks in it. It was heartbreaking. Um, so yeah, it was bad. Like both sides were gone. So only the second box basically that was the whole everything that was in that box was gone which were the whole sides um the other box was fine actually there's a, a an indent in the cardboard in that box that tells us that probably they put the other one on top of it like this and that's why they broke it other than that there's the fact that DHL tried was that even an attempt to <laughs> tape it back i i can't even i mean i can laugh about it because the update that i'm about to give you is a good thing but i couldn't believe it they taped it back pieces falling out and uh the tape was saying repacked i mean how do you even deliver that like call me and you know tell me what happened it's funny though because um they were supposed to deliver days before and they didn't and i when when the desk didn't arrive after the delivery date was um set for a given day they didn't deliver it and the next day was like uh the the, the next delivery date is unknown and i was like that is strange if it was here and it was supposed to deliver at 7 p.m how is now unknown how is not the, the next day you know, and now it's unknown. So I got on the phone with them and I'm glad I did because I started to have like direct contact with them on the phone with human beings instead of bots. And I was keep tracking and tracking and tracking and tracking until they delivered it. So as soon as I got that, I got back on the phone. I actually spoke with uh, a representative, uh, a supervisor at DHL. But before going to the DHL, updates on the desk. Mods and Furniture, which is the company that's giving me this desk, is the best company, the best custom support ever, on top of making amazing desks. You check, check those out. There's a reason because I picked that one. Overnight, the same day that the whole mess happened, the whole disaster happened, the same night, they are in Paris, so there's also time zone. The same night, they just went in and rebuilt my two sides overnight. I woke up in the morning and I found a picture they sent me that they just remade them. And that was like, they are amazing. So overnight they remade my sides because they didn't want me to be without a desk any longer. Uh, they had, uh, in that picture, they had the first layer of paint. They were telling me like, we we're gonna finish paint them, wait for them to dry and then ship them along with the uh, main monitor stands. My monitor stands for the big EVE Audio are going to be Modson as well. They have incredible looking uh, stands for big monitors. You will see them. Uh, you will see them when we are, have this room ready, but you can take a look right now. Since I gave away the brand, I wanted to keep it a secret, but yeah, they will be shipped in uh, hardwood boxes this time uh, from Paris to here. But this is just to say Modson is the best customer service that I've ever seen. 
like literally overnight when the CEO was on the on, on an email with me, he had people building my new sites uh, in real time, basically overnight. And they were ready the next morning, you know, ready to be uh, finished painting and, and shipped. So next week from this video, uh, at the end of next week, they are gonna ship it back. Again, express shipping, of course, uh, so let's see how it goes this time. This is gonna be like a like a mini series. Let's see if my desk makes it in one piece. But yeah, this is pretty amazing from Modson, and they did this uh, without waiting. That's the main point. Without waiting any response from DHL, because I talked to DHL. I actually demanded to be um, transferred to a supervisor, thanks to some friend of mine working in law. Uh, we talked to a supervisor and the supervisor was all super nice on the phone until it, it wasn't, until he tried to say, like I mentioned in the video, yeah, we will reimburse everything, we will reimburse the shipping cost. And we were like, no, you're not going to reimburse the shipping cost, you're going to reimburse the item itself. We have an invoice, that desk is expensive. <laughs> and um, they were like, well, we are going to reimburse the item if we can prove that it was us. Uh, what he meant is he said they had cameras at the deposit where they load and unload stuff. If the camera catched an employee dropping it, or you know, we can see that the, the crate was damaged by us, we are gonna reimburse. And we were like, no, that's a loophole because what if they weren't in front of the camera? What if they dropped it when they were around, moving it around? That's complete bullshit. So the worst part for them is they happen to deliver to <laughs> me. Uh, not only I have a YouTube channel, but I was filming the arrival of the crate. You only saw a snip in the previous video, but I actually have on video the whole arrival when they unloaded the, the broken crate from the truck and they were carrying it, it was, they were wheeling it to me. And I was at the top level and I filmed everything, so I have everything on video. When the guy just arrived, you can see that the crate is all busted already. So it doesn't matter. If you guys, if you DHL didn't catch your uh, employees dropping it, I did. <laughs> because the, the crate arrived that way. So for them, and it's not gonna end well. I mean, they have no loophole. They have no, you know, getaway. But this is, you know, if you deal with something like this, those are all, all loopholes, you know? They will, they, we will pay if we, can, if we can prove it. And even if I didn't catch it on video, you used a repack tape. How, like, like I said there, how, stupid are you like it that's your tape <laughs> i don't i don't own a dhl repack tape to put in myself so this whole thing is like so messed up i don't even understand why how a big company like this can even think that is acceptable even try to get away with that but um yeah um at the end of the phone call with the supervisor he gave me what he said a claim number uh to follow Turned out the next day they called me back the next morning and they said, and a fourth person that I spoke at DHL, they said, oh, that's not a claim number. That's some sort of other number, um, whatever that was. And basically they said, it's not you that has to claim, it's the, the sender, which makes sense. Uh, but I, of course, I now provided all the, all the proof to the sender, to Modson, so they can open the claim over there and they have plenty of proof that, you know, the the crate arrived that way and it was still in the box with pieces falling out. But uh, we will see how this goes. I will keep you updated on what the company tells me DHL is doing. If they reimburse, they don't reimburse, we'll see that. But the good news on my side is Modson has been an amazing company. They already rebuilt my desk and so next week, is gonna be here stay tuned so we'll see if it comes in one piece <laughs> so this is it for this video unusual content but i hope you enjoyed it anyway thank you for watching leave your comments down below and see you next time